How do you get your name changed if you fail to do it in your final decree of divorce or in an adoption? My name is Laura Hurd, and I have been helping people with family law in San Antonio, Texas and surrounding counties for over 35 years. And there is a procedure to get a legal name change. You can change your name to anything you want as long as it's not misleading people or attempting to uh, have some illegal purpose as long as you're an adult. If you're a minor, you have to have the consent of both parents. But if you're an adult, you don't need anyone's consent. There is a petition that you would file. Um, the, there is a filing fee, and then your attorney would also prepare the final order for the judge to sign. You have to go get your official fingerprint record and your official criminal background check. And the court has to see your fingerprint record, your criminal background check, and you must swear that you're not doing it to avoid creditors or to avoid being prosecuted for a crime. So if you have no illegal purpose, you have a good reason to get your name changed, you can change it to anything you want, but there is a court procedure to go through. Once you get that certified copy of the order from the judge changing your name, then you must get a new birth certificate from the Bureau of Vital Statistics. There's a separate fee for that, and it takes a long time. It's, it's, they're generally waiting like two, three months, four months even, to get a new birth certificate. With your new birth certificate and the order changing your name, you can go get a new driver's license, and with that, you can go get a new social security card. So there's a lot of bureaucracy and red tape in getting all those documents changed, but you can do it.